Welcome to this guide for chained echoes. In this video, we will look into how to get an emblem, and the emblem in question is called the monk, and it has a name Olivian the monk, and it can be found in the Kindreld Monastery. And the Kindreld Monastery is part of the main story, so the location you will definitely visit. You cannot avoid going there, but while there, you might miss collecting the Olivian the Monk emblem because it is sort of at a hidden location and you can trigger the main story event. And if you do, then you are forced to leave before you can collect this emblem and you will have to return at a later point. So let's not try and do that. So the thing you want to avoid is to leave the building at the northernmost point, you will be outside in the garden and you can push upwards. And if you do that, eventually you will leave the area and that will trigger, well, a series of happenings that will make you leave the monastery. So do not leave through the northmost uh, entry and then do not leave the screen. If you do, then you have to return at a later point. So what you need to have with you in either case, in order to be able to get the emblem is sacred water. It's an item and you might already have one or even two because you can find several. But when I made my way to the monastery, I only had one because I had already used other one. And that's why I am looking at this map. This is the area with the, the underground tunnels leading to the Kindreld monastery and where I am at right now a little uh, pointer, that is where you can find a chest with sacred water. So make sure that you do that because we need that water for the Kindreld Monastery eventually. Also, if you are finding this guide helpful, I would love it if you hit those like and subscribe buttons and comments are always welcome as well, of course. Now let's look on the route inside of the monastery. So I decided to start here because this at the very beginning of the area where the merchant is and then you just follow along the route I am taking. This is a fairly big place so be aware where you're going. So up the stairs here and onto the roof and then up again and here we have the statue. And as always, this will lead to sort of a mini boss encounter. I had no problem at this point in game to beat this fight. And uh, that was me having fought every enemy on my way here. So uh, yeah, I'm not sure in what state you will be, but I had no trouble beating this fight. So here we are, fight is done. And we have the monk emblem and you can now equip that emblem before pushing ahead with the main story so that is an added bonus there is nothing in this game that is totally missable so if you miss picking this up on your first try you can return later but it's nice to have it as quickly as possible but there we go you should now have the emblem Thank you for watching this guide. Hopefully now you have the monk emblem. If you enjoyed it, I would love to hit those like and subscribe buttons. And I would also love it if I saw you again in future videos. But for now, it's time to say bye bye.